Speaker with Richard Bergen. Richard Bergen. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Serco is at the heart of an outsourced tracing system that's failing to contact one third of all the close contacts of those with coronavirus. That's clearly helping the virus to spread out of control. So there's widespread public concern that the government is in hoc to these giant outsourcing companies. Concerns at Serco and the like aren't just ripping off the public, but they're putting lives in danger. So does the Secretary of State think that the public should be reassured or worried by the fact that Serco's former chief spin doctor is now his Minister for Health? Well, Secretary of State. Mr Speaker, um, I, I don't think he was listening to the debate, do you? Because I just previously pointed out not only that the national system in the last week has more than doubled the number of contacts that it's reached, more than doubled, and I pay tribute to them for that, that it is the teamwork between the national and the local system that works best, and that it is the combination of the large-scale private organisations and the public sector, people working together, that is able to deliver and deliver a better service. And I'll tell you this, Mr Speaker, there was a time in the last few days when we had requests from local systems to bring some of the contact tracing back into the national Serco system so that they could help to reach more people. And that sort of teamwork is what I look for, instead of the negative, derisory, divisive approach of the yeah. honourable gentleman up there.